Yo, what's up, beautiful people? So, today is Friday, April 8th, 2022. But you all are watching this video April 12th, 2022, which is also my birthday. So, yes, thank you for all the birthday wishes. But I also have a confession to make to you all when it comes to me making these YouTube videos. But first, I gotta open up this package. So, in this box here is something that I've been wanting for a minute now. Like, like since the day I heard about the actual campaign shoot since I seen all of the uh, contests on Instagram and since I've come to know who this individual is and their work, their career leading up to this point, not necessarily uh, for designing this piece, but just overall what they have done for creatives and artists alike. So, in here, okay, first of all, there we go. So, by now, if you don't know, these are the New Balance and Soleil Bimbery on um, collab. These are the first uh, Yeet edition. All right, guys. Uh, future editor Bruno here because clearly. I didn't know what I was talking about there um, in the video, but the shoes that I picked up are the second collection of the Slay Bimbery and New Balance uh, partnership or collaboration, and specifically the Yurt collection. The first collection was the uh, Water Big Air Guide collection where he did the 2002 uh, New Balance R, and they were like till, a till pair like teal and blue or teal and green and then there was an orange pair yeah now that we got that cleared up um <laughs> back to the video it'll focus here y'all see that so yeah here they are jeez so yeah i had to inspect the shoe real quick but here these bad boys are make this a thumbnail so to finally have a pair of his shoes a piece of art that he designed is definitely you know a piece that i'm adding to the collection and i am very excited about so you know you guys want to see how I put this whole fit together or what I wear with these? Stop this video right now and head over to my Instagram right now, more than likely. And you should be able to see how we rocking these today. But uh but yeah, definitely shout out to Slay. These uh new balances, five seven fours are definitely goaded. And then yeah. We'll throw some clips up there as far as like what this tab is back in the middle. Yeah, with that being said, let's uh let's get back to today's video. Okay, so here's the confession. When it comes to YouTube and making these videos, whether it's a tutorial or a vlog or a sit down 
I have two outputs or thoughts about how I feel about actually making these videos. So one, there's a side of me that wants to have like the best production possible for these videos to just one, for me personally to experiment and test and try and to create and learn new lighting techniques, new audio techniques or how to bounce light here, how to, you know, block light out here and just create a space where I can practice, you know, lighting, being a DP, being a cinematographer, and then create that experience or a unique experience for you all. But then, so if you hear something chewing right now, that is Lola on her bone. I'll give you guys a quick look at that. So here's Lola right here. So yeah, if you hear chewing, that is Lola and I apologize. So yeah, and then the second outlook or how I view these videos is that I also don't want to overproduce on these videos to make it seem that you all at home who do, you know, follow the channel, subscribe and keep up and interact with me here, feel like you can't do something similar without all of this gear or X amount of gear and feel like I'm on a level, you know, way beyond you all or, you know, not, or whatever the case may be. And I don't want it to feel like that because I know when I was starting out on YouTube or just creating and in this field as a videographer or photographer, there's always that aspiration or not that aspiration or just that thought that, oh, if I only just have this gear, I'll be able to do X, Y, and Z. Or, oh, if I can only get this camera or if only if I can get this lens, I'll be able to create videos like your favorite YouTuber here on the platform. And I don't want you all to feel like that when you come here on this channel. I want this channel to be, or I want you all to look at me and this channel like, I'm you, like I'm one of you, like I'm just a normal guy in this home creating videos for the internet or for YouTube or for the world. So with that being said, I've been trying to balance out that or those two viewpoints, those two spectrums and try to find a nice medium somewhere in between where I can, you know, easily turn around these videos for you all but also give you guys a somewhat of an not necessarily an elevated taste or an elevated production but just to show you all that i actually care and put some thought and effort into these videos that i'm not just pushing out videos just because for you know for the heck of it so yeah with that being said man i hope that when you all come here you all are feeling welcomed Hope you all feel that this is a safe space for all of you all to share your creative thoughts and ideas down in the comment section. Um, yeah, I mean, we're all in this together. I'm here for you, you know, to help you all grow, become better photographers, cinematographers, editors. And I hope that you all to continue to show up for me and support me because, you know, that's why I'm here to be able to give back to you all and in the turn you all help me by offering your viewership and your time to actually sit down and watch these videos so with that being said um i know this video is in the future before my actual birthday but yeah i'm gonna go off finish celebrating with my family and friends and i'll see you guys later this week so Peace.